couple weeks ago, I told you that this winter would be the record setting winter and you shouldn't wait till spring. Here's why. Hey friends, it's Andy Nazaroff with the Nazaroff team for this week's Real Estate Corner. As I record this, it's the first week of December and I was looking at our local stats this last week, the other day, just a couple days ago, and I was stunned because I saw something that just about a month or so ago I told you about, I was amazed that it was at 444. And that's our active inventory in Fresno and Clovis. Today, it's just over 300. The number of homes for sale has significantly dropped to the degree that in some areas where we're looking at comparable market analysis or we're you know, showing a buyer one property, we wanna show them another property similar to it, and you're not finding one home active that's in the immediate neighborhood. And I mean by like a quarter mile or a half mile immediate neighborhood. There's only one home active. So what does that mean? If you're a buyer, I think you need to work with a team that is aggressively going to hunt for you. Hunting means they're looking at inventory, they're connecting with neighborhoods, they're marketing into neighborhoods for you to help you find a home, not just waiting for you to see one on the MLS. If you're a seller, I think it really means you have to have a strategy because in this market, there is such a thing as selling your home too fast. And you could get too many offers too quickly that need you to move and not have a home to move to. It's okay, we have a strategy for both. So connect with us, would love to have a conversation about what you're looking to do. But I want you to know, I'm kind of being a little bit tongue in cheek. I was right, this winter is already setting records. Inventory decreasing means prices are going up, interest rates are staying low, and uh, sellers are benefiting as long as they have a strategy. Now, if you're a buyer looking to buy in this market, couple things. You have to have realistic expectations that you're going to have to make multiple offers, that you shouldn't fall in love with the first home that you see, that um, you may want to, if you're pre-approved to here, you may want to search to here so that leaves you room to overbid because many homes are. More things we could talk about if you reach out. Look forward to connecting with you. Until next time.